final little bits. Our four looks so weird. Oh, ah. Poppy Stray Poppy's been. Isn't catching the central swamp, so nothing to catch over here, but that's fine. Who the fuck cares about that? I mean, we got a giant fucking lake that we can draw food from. Speaking of which, we need to start making a few more drinks. For some reason, our brewer dwarf has stopped doing that. A, B, repeat. You're still constructing beds. Good. Rock blocks. Good. So we can build our ruins. Good. 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 Um... So makers alone. Yeah, I set that to work, and that was doing fine. Butcher animal, slaughter animal. We're going to need more of those. So yeah, we're gonna set you to make a few caskets on repeat, because we're gonna need those, and we're also gonna need to set up a little memorial area for all my unlucky dwarves. Wall. Yeah, we're just gonna fix this area up for that really bitty dwarf. I probably should have given this area over here to the... Oh, you okay, guy? He, he seems he's a bit unhappy. Been happy lately, dining in a great dining room, has been annoyed by flies, slept in a very good bedroom, and my own fine news, caught in the rain, my own fine table, admired a tastefully arranged table lately, so this one's fine. Let's check our other noble. Been quite content. She slept in a poor bedroom, Rudy. Really. Fuck you. She slept in a poor dining room recently. Fuck you. She's just been satisfied at work lately. She had my own fine. She dined in a very poor dining room. God damn it. She received water recently. She just slept in an awful bedroom. She admired a fine seat lately. She has been annoyed by flies. My own fine. I hate, hate nobles like that. I'm half tempted to kill her. I would really hate him. She just does not do me any favors. She's not done anything to help my group at all. And yet she's so bitchy. God damn it. I mean, you don't do that shit. Also, I think I messed up on something. So yeah, they shouldn't shoot at this, right? And I thought fucked up. I think I might have fucked up a little bit. <laughs> oh well. Also, this guy over here is just glowing red. What's wrong with you? Been unhappy, so that's a good reason. She's been accosted by terrible vermin, caught disgusted by my husband, and has been satisfied at work. There's very little cheekbones, her hair is blah, and that's blah, so... They're just not happy. They've just not been having good times, so... Diorite. Diorite. Construction present? What? What's... What? Whatever. We're gonna have to set this up first, aren't we? Fuck the world! Diorite. Oh, fuck. Whatever. We'll have that set up later. They're just not happy, and I don't know why. Also, aim your liaison from the mountain home. Let's discuss your situation. Yeah, except you're really not going to do a damn thing, are you? Also, I think that our, my little plan here didn't work. I don't know if he fixed that, or if that was the bug for a while, or what, but I guess that doesn't work anymore. I mean, that's fine. I just... I, I could have swore that's how it would work. Like, if the... Or maybe that was in the adventure mode. I don't know. Somebody somebody who knows, tell me on that. Because I'm actually really curious on that. Because I could have swore. I could have sworn. I don't really want anything. You liaisons can bring whatever you want. I'm going to end up stealing it all anyway through a random series of events that is very, very, very convenient for me. Not for you so much, but still. So I guess we'll just pave that floor in there and just do whatever. I don't know. Because they've not gone over here to train, and when that wasn't there, they were training perfectly fine. But now that it's... I don't know. I don't like that. That's weird to me. It's really weird to me. So they're still building that. I got lots of animals. I might start having... I might start slaughtering some of these guys. I mean, not because I don't like the animals. Don't get me wrong. I love animals, but... You can see they're eating all our grass. 
We really don't need all these animals either. I mean... I mean, it's... It'd be fine. We'll stray this... You... A ram, a donkey... We'll just cut down a bunch of these and hope it helps. Because we can kill some of these because they're old. So we'll just cut down on these. We'll get a lot of food from this, mind you, but still. Do 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 do. Killing this red ring blackbird. Not gonna get much from that. Tame rat. We'll kill your ass. Fuck you. Actually, we can because it, yeah, we can't really kill that stuff, can we? Fuck. I think I'm going to need to build a second B workshop butchers, which is you, which I could not remember to save my fucking life. Whatever. We're going to be slaughtering a bunch of animals. We need the food anyway, I guess. That guy in there is still stark raving fucking mad. Let's actually check on him a little bit. Mechanic. He's been miserable, ladies. Complain of thirst, woken by a noise, slept in a very good bedroom, weird. Dine in a legendary dining room. He's been annoyed by a fly. He's talked with a friend. Admired on fine bed. Admired on fine days of the... Surprising, actually. I think he started taking off his clothes, because all he's wearing is his cap, gloves, a sock, and shoe. So he's kind of nudifying himself in there. Luckily, none of our other dwarves have to be exposed by that, so yes, I am thinking of the children on this one. Remember, trade agreement strengthen bounds. Bounds, bounds, bounds. I don't give a fuck. And so their butcher shop is going to get made. Should have a lot of animals being slaughtered. On fucking mass, too. So yes, we will set this up. You guys will train. Squad, C, active training. So yes, they should be doing that. They should be coming to do that at least. Meow. Stray cat's been tamed. Stray kin's been uh, struck down. Poor thing, poor thing. I think after this episode, like before I start the next one, I'm gonna start jotting down plans for the other four that we're gonna submerge in the water. Just because we kind of, I kind of need to have something ready for that. I don't want to go into it completely blind. Mind you, it's not, it wouldn't be the first time I've gone into something blind, cough, cough, this whole entire fucking fort. But, I think it's for the best if I actually have some idea of what I'm going to be getting into. So we will set this to be done right. I not put any, no, we can't reach that yet. That's fine. That's fine with me. Let's become a swords dwarf. No, but pause. Ah, get out of that pause. Do we still have anything over here? We do have... Oh, these are just busted leather. Why didn't anyone get these? I would have figured lots of people would have liked that. And there's a bunch of... That's just a bunch of fucking random, like, broken arrows. Wait, I heard something scream. Oh, stray you, okay. It makes random noise for random shit, so you'll have to excuse me on that. And I think the dwarves are still moving all sorts of stuff. Yeah, they're still smoothing this out, which is making all of the dwarves happy. We're gonna I'm probably going to need to like I said, make a burial burial area. Which I will probably put over here. And we're also gonna set up a wall here just to make this dwarf a little less bitchy. Diorite. And we'll just set up a two by Fuck you, I don't give a goddamn. Shut up. Go away. Mine. Shut up, I don't care. I could normally that'd be fine, dandy, yes, thank you. Trade agreements, yes, fine, good. Yeah. Totally, man. But I really couldn't care less, to be perfectly honest. So we're gonna just set up little two by two rooms for each casket. Why two by two? The fuck off I know. 
I don't know how. I don't know the reason behind half the shit I do in this this one. The tutorial, I know kind of. I kind of know what I'm going to do in advance, but in this, I kind of don't actually. Actually, I have a better idea. And I'm just doing like this. It's so much easier. Yeah, I don't know why it's doing it the other way. I was just. I don't even know. I don't even know sometimes about myself, and we'll probably make all these like, and it'll make the families of the people who died happy that we're doing it like this, because it's like, oh my god, they have their own like little room, and it's so big, it's like a little, like a little room, a little house that we have, and it'll be, they'll be happy, so, oh my god, this is getting so annoying so annoying so quickly stop it stop it thank you so we'll just set that up yeah and I think that'll be all we need except we will set up a bigger room kind of up here for one special dwarf who does something amazing Whoever, whatever dwarf we have, actually we'll set up another room over here like that. Whenever we have a dwarf who does something spectacular, we will dedicate an entire mausoleum to them. So we'll just make this one smaller, just for the sake of consistency. Actually, yeah, we'll expand it out. Mm -hmm. So yeah, whatever dwarf does something really good is going to get an amazing room. We didn't even set this to be dug out, did we? I was going to make this area over here originally just, you know, more nobles' quarters, but I like the idea of having a nice big open area over here just for dwarves to get buried. Because we're going to need it. Let's be honest. Let me, let's be honest for once. We're going to have bitches die in this fort. Bitches are going to die everywhere. And what is you what is you having trouble with? I haven't the faintest. So yeah, this archer over here, who are you? You are Riley Riley Archer. Very good. And he's just shooting shit. Training and training and training. I'm half tempted to remove that in front of him, but Something tells me if I did that, it just he'd just start moving to another one, and then all my work would be for fucking naught. See, let's try that. Move construction right there. That seems to be the one he likes practicing on, so... So yeah, as soon as I did that, and as soon as somebody was going to come over here and do it, he just leaves, so... That is an issue. Make archery range. Fucking... Hey, we're going to have to do this to all of them, aren't we? It seems. Archery is not usually something I like to do. Because it, it's just really annoying, all in all. Train. Make archery range. Train. Shoot from right to left. Right to left. To left. So all these should be the same now. So we should have multiple dwarves coming up here to train. Another baby. Cook has given birth to a boy. Cats. Yay, I guess. Whatever. They're still smoothing out these floors and walls and shit, and that's gonna take for fucking ever. But at least they're getting trained in something that'll be useful eventually. Right? Maybe. Also, they stopped digging out shit because... I guess they got bored, whatever. Keep digging, damn it! I didn't tell you to stop digging. I also removed their ability to remove their own, or to pause the game when that shit happens. So that even when they're like, but we don't want to do it anymore, they'll keep doing it because I say so. Or at least the game won't pause. Dig that, damn it. Also, how's our food doing? Yes, we're getting up to quite a lot of meat. We have more meat than fish now. Not surprising, because all our because our dwarves just love to eat that fish. I bet the men love the women, don't they? Um, I didn't say that. 
I didn't say a damn thing. What are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. B bids. You know, the only thing you can really watch is the stuff down here. Now, I'm going to pause the game right now, and I'm going to start planning out a little bit of the stuff down below. So, I'll see you in the next episode.